How's it going everybody? It's Sick here back again with TA3 Productions and Vindictive Gaming and today we have some pretty exciting news. Today we're going to be showcasing the new Hunger Games map I've been working on. It's going to be called Jungle Paradise and the reason why I named it that is because I just used a lot of jungle trees and it looks like a, a paradise island. It's like it's like an old fashioned kind of style. It's like an old medieval kind of feel. But um, I'm one of the people that don't believe too much in styles, so uh, I don't want to say that it's a medieval. It's, it has a lot of mixture of styles, so I'm not going to just classify it. But anyways, let's go ahead and showcase it. So at the top here, this is where some people will spawn. And um, some people were dying, you know, they were like, oh my god, how am I going to get down here? So we made a little drop down. It's actually a pretty cool little feature that I really enjoy that's in the game. And uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. Like I said, you come and see this, you can actually see down the hallway right there. But um, once you're done with that, you can come over here and come where the normal people will spawn spawn in here and you walk in here now I'm pretty sure y'all seen the door it's made by sci-fi guy I think 86 and uh, that guy just does some amazing redstone I will put his link in the description uh, sci-fi guy if you're watching this you're an awesome best owner and a uh, pretty awesome minecrafter as well but um anyways yeah like I want to I want to talk about the people that actually helped me I didn't do all this by myself there was a lot of people that were involved but um, I did do a lot of it, but like I said, there was so many people that were involved, I can't take full credit for this. Some of the names off the top would be, uh, of course, Sci-Fi Guy, TyPro. TyPro has probably helped me a lot the last couple of days. It's ridiculous how much he's helped me, so I do appreciate that. I probably wouldn't even be done if it wasn't for him helping me the last couple of days. Uh, Minjil, BG, SMN, there was a lot of people that were really involved. A lot of the Vindictive Gaming Build Team. If you don't know about the Vindictive Gaming Build Team, basically it was a team that I created... And then I had to step away because I was getting super busy, so I basically like pushed them off in their little boat, and uh, they turned it into a ship. So I will link their uh, their channel in the description. So check them out; they do a lot of stuff. It's basically a build team that I sponsor, and um, they do a lot of awesome stuff. And uh, yeah, but anyways, let's go ahead and jump right into it. Like I said, I want to showcase a lot of this as much as possible, so you guys can uh, check it out. If you want to download it, there will be a download when we get to 50 likes, just because um, I have to do all the stuff to get it together and ready for download. So uh, by the time we get to 50 likes, I'll have all that ready and uh, you guys can be playing this as soon as possible. But um, yeah, anyways, check it out. Basically, there's a lot of like a little, it's basically a small village with a, a medieval feel like I said before. But um, it has all kinds of mixtures of uh, just different kind of things. This is basically the main building. This is the church that we worked really hard on. Um, this was started by BG and I basically finished it and took it to a whole nother level and I really enjoyed the way it came out like I said it, it, it just looks ridiculous how awesome it is and um, yeah there's all kinds of stuff there's like a library there's a school room there's the communion and all that stuff there's even up there on the top there's the choir place so um, that's actually pretty cool a lot of these buildings are very very uh, detailed and then some of them are basically locked out to where there's no interior at all and you can see that by uh, seeing like a uh, iron door if you see an iron door you can't go into that building however for the most part you can get into pretty much any of these buildings such as this one this is basically my house on the map and uh, I will tell you the inside of that building is pretty awesome uh, Typro helped me a lot with that one it's pretty cool this was basically I think done by sci-fi guy he did the it's like a pub area like a bar slash uh, restaurant for the olden style days a pub I guess would be the right name uh, over here we got a, basically a cemetery which is pretty cool pretty eerie though because if you want to come in here, you're basically going to be robbing uh, corpses and stuff. So you're going to be robbing like their jewelry and stuff. So by taking their gold or their iron, it's going to be pretty pretty interesting. Over here, we basically have a VGBT kind of marked in there. And uh, we also have a nice little cave system that we made in. Over here, we have a, um, a nice little market. Because it's like the old days, they had these markets. And uh, we don't see these too much these days. Over here, we basically have a boat. And then you go into these caves. These caves are actually man made basically with some TNT. And then once the TNT was done, we went in and make basically like uh, carved them the way we wanted to. But um, that's pretty much it. Over here, we have a nice little windmill, and then we have a nice little village. This is kind of like the poor man village. So they're secluded on their own little mountain, living how they want to, not like everybody else. But um, anyways, guys, this has been the map. Hopefully, you guys are really excited and want to download it. All you have to do is basically like this video and uh, let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Do you like it? Do you not like it? Is it too small? Is it too big? I really like small maps because I don't like people like searching for the other players and stuff like that. And uh, yeah, a bunch of crazy stuff like that. But um, anyways, I have been sick of the six. Hopefully you guys are really excited and really enjoy this map. Let me know in the comment section below. And until next time, guys, later.